and welcome to the Estes Park News Weekend Report for the first weekend in March. I'm Chris Hazelton. Many have already enjoyed the Repertory Theatre Company's current production of Hot Flashes. Their first weekend is behind them with very strong attendance at their first three performances. The cast and crew will now return to the Studio Theatre at the Masonic Lodge this Friday and Saturday at 7 p.m. to bring you this hilarious play. Just a note, the Sunday, March 9th matinee is now sold out. Seating at the Studio Theatre at the Masonic Lodge is very limited. You can purchase tickets at McDonald Bookshop downtown or at the door prior to performance. Come learn about the Rocky Mountain National Park's exciting Centennial plans and how you can get involved next Wednesday, March 12th at 6 p.m. at the Beaver Meadows Visitor Center in Rocky Mountain National Park. The park's 100th anniversary celebration will encourage people to rediscover and reconnect with the wilderness and wildlife in Rocky. Centennial celebrations only come around once every 100 years. Don't let this one pass you by. Play the horses, try your luck at blackjack, poker, roulette, and craps, or just come for a good time at Sunrise Rotary's Casino Night next Saturday, March 15th at the Stanley Hotel. This popular Sunrise Rotary fundraiser raises money to benefit the Bobcat Boosters Club. In addition, the fun night offers raffle prizes, a DJ, photo booth, hors d'oeuvres, and a cash bar. Entry is free for those 21 and over, and everyone receives play money to gamble at the various events. Sunrise Rotary is recruiting sponsors for the horse race, poker table, roulette, and crap table. To sign up for the poker tournament or to inquire about sponsorships, please call Harriet Woodard at 586-1040. Daylight Savings Time starts this Sunday and the Estes Valley Fire Protection District reminds us to change and test the batteries in our smoke alarms and carbon monoxide detectors twice a year when we change our clocks. Working smoke alarms increase the chance of surviving a home fire by 50%. Don't forget to spring forward this weekend. Yeah. That's it for this week. I'm Chris Hazelton with the Estes Park News. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you back here next week. Rock the Casbah, rock the Casbah, over at the temple. Oh, they really pack them in.